Gina, according to West Lafayette Police, Tendam is now at the Tippecanoe County Jail after being treated for gunshot wounds and released from an Indianapolis area hospital. According to a probable cause affidavit filed today, West Lafayette Police Officers Michael Max and Mark Ridge shot Tendam after he pointed a replica handgun at them. West Lafayette Police Chief Jason Domkowski says this isn't Tendam's first encounter with local police, though. We take a closer look at some of Tendam's prior run-ins. 42-year-old Eric Tendam has been arrested after his involvement in a police action shooting Friday. Court documents say West Lafayette police officers Michael Max and Mark Ridge witnessed Tendam driving a lawn tractor erratically down a city street and yelling unintelligible things about a bomb. A public search of Tendam's criminal past shows his history with police includes charges of driving while intoxicated and a future court date for driving on a suspended license. In October of 2008, Tendam was arrested on arson charges after he allegedly set his own home on fire. Those charges were later dropped. Tippecanoe County Prosecutor Pat Harrington says technically the county could not pursue arson charges against Tendam in that case. He owned the home. In Indiana, the law on arson is that you, you basically, it requires that you not only are intentionally damage property of another. In this case, he burned his own property. Daniel Moore has represented Tendam in the past on a driving while intoxicated conviction, as well as the dropped arson case. Moore says there was also a question of Tendam's mental state of mind at the time of the fire. I mean, on the court record, file a, a notice of mental disease or defect, and that's a pleading. Uh, it doesn't admit that you committed the crime, but it basically you know, says you believe you're not guilty of the crime because you weren't capable of forming the correct intent. Moore says he's had no contact with Tendam since Friday, but says the shooting incident came as a surprise. I recognized the name when I saw him, but yeah, it was shocking to me. I mean, you know, in, in my interactions with him, he's been, uh, you know, very pleasant and easy to deal with. Moore says Tendam has not approached him for representation on Friday's incident. Tippecanoe County now has 72 hours to file formal charges against Tendam. Alex Dyro, News Channel 18.